Hello class, welcome to week number 15, only a couple more weeks left. This week we'll be covering chapter 11 in the technology in action, and this will be the last chapter that we cover in the tech in action book. I feel that chapters 12 and 13 almost go too deep into for an introduction to computer and information systems. So this week we'll be talking behind the scenes, database and information systems. This is broken up into two major sections. The first is database basics that discusses database building blocks, database types, and database functions. The second section is how businesses use databases, and that's broken into database warehousing and storage, business intelligence systems, and data mining. Shiho, uh, one of your classmates, pointed out that there are two pages missing from the book, specifically page 510 and 511. If you go into the Blackboard, you'll like, so you're here in Blackboard now, and there's pictures to each of those pages that I took from my iPhone that are up there for you. So as always, look over the PowerPoint and then take the quiz. This week you have um, four, three assignments active help desk call assignment essay one this is going to be in the at the end of the first section database basics and the critical thing or check your understanding section and you're going to do essay question number one databases are everywhere although the book says to provide 10 examples i only need you to have to provide four and then i even gave you a couple examples that you might want to use some social media sites such as Facebook and some internet stores such as Amazon. So you can use those two, but you still have to pick two more. So make sure you answer the question fully for each database. You have to discuss the specific advantages these databases have in your daily life, as well as some of the precautions you need to take to ensure your privacy. Also, we, we did the journal at the first half of the semester. What I'd like to do now is have you do a second half journal entry that'll be the same as a first half, but you'll just basically be answering that um, from the second half uh, that, that'll cover the whole entire semester. For week 17, you're going to have two assignments. One's going to be the final exam. And that's going to cover chapters 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and 11. And I'm also going to have you build a Pong game in Scratch. Scratch is what you used with Anna and Elsa um, for last week's programmers, programming study. I just thought it was pretty cool to create this Pong game. So you guys will create that. I have four videos. I found four videos online that will walk you through creating that video, but you will have to create a Scratch account. So here's a link to Scratch, scratch.mit.edu. And then once you create a site or create an account, you'll be able to create a project and walk through these videos to create a Pong game. Once you create your game, what I'd like you to do is create a short Jing video showing your Pong game. So I just provided this early to students in case they wanted to get a jump, but this will not be due until week 17. Next week, we'll be covering an access database assignment, but you can also use Open Office to complete this assignment. So whether you have a Windows machine, a Mac, or a Linux machine, you can get Open Office if you don't have uh, Microsoft Access. And I don't care if you use Access 10 or 2010 or Access 2013, either is fine. Another option is to go to the Learning Resource Center on campus, the library, and each of the workstations at the library also have Microsoft Office 2013. So that covers this week. As always, please let me know if you have any questions. And um, the best advice now is to stay strong and make sure you finish out the, 
the semester with a you know that top grade. All right, guys, take care. See ya. Bye.